I'm David, and this is my attempt to send a radio-controlled airplane into the edge of space using a weather balloon. The internet is full of videos of people sending things high into the atmosphere. But David notched up 700,000 hits and made it into our top five because he decided to pilot his plane back down. This is quite amazing. He sent his glider all the way up in space and he could still control it. That's a marvelous piece of engineering. The plane is now 20 miles away. So how is David gonna pull this off? David is actually controlling his glider using radio waves. But if he has a standard radio wave antenna, he would need a lot of power to be able to control that glider. So he has to fit signal boosters onto all his radio equipment. But what he does to increase the range is make them directional. So rather than the radio waves scattering all over the place, they're focused into a tight beam, which means they're able to go much further. But if you go off axis with it, you will lose the connection and, of course, lose control. So he's got his mate in the car, so when he releases the glider, they desperately drive along trying to track the glider underneath so they can stay in contact with it. So by making his antenna directional, David can control this glider over 20 miles away. I'm starting to pilot the plane and I glide for as long as I can just to enjoy the scenery. Despite a rough landing, David's flight is a hit with our experts. He was able to control this glider and fly it down. So I think that this was a highly successful mission for him.